Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Cry of Fear. Uh, we're gonna do one more episode here before I wind up cutting out because I do like this game. I really do. It's the repetitive trudging crap though that's really kind of ruining it. I don't know. Then again, it could be my own error. I really don't know anymore. Could just as easily be like my own error. Hammer! There's something in the train now, isn't there? Well, oh, that works. Okay. I didn't even expect him to pop up, I just left clicked and he fucking died instantaneously. It was awesome. What are you looking at? Anybody else want to catch me off guard? There's two of them. It's got a wicked slow load time, though. Oh my god. Oh my god. No! What the fuck, guy? Like, really? Waste all the ammo, I guess. Fucking hell. And the health, too. Okay, so let's go ahead and, uh, yeah. That didn't happen. Now we gotta go and fucking break that thing, actually. I'm gonna put that in the one slot now. How did I get in here? I don't even remember. I really don't even remember how I got in here. Was it down there? I think it was. Yeah. Okay. I don't even know what to say anymore. Whenever I go through those moments earlier in the fucking recording session where I'm just enraged of trying to fucking repeat an action 90 times in a row, I don't even know what to say for the rest of anything. But I know it is going to be done. Bang! Bang! I said... Bang! Physics! All right. I hear shaky breathing. What the fuck? I think I'm in another twisted, fucked up universe. Yeah. Yeah, that's a safe assumption. I remember this. There's gonna be a lot of parkour, possibly a lot of failing, and more than likely, a lot of repetition. But who knows? I might get lucky. damage, but alright, whatever. What the fuck? Alright, whatever. I guess when you accidentally double tap in a direction, it launches you off the side. Alright. So let's try that one again. The blurry screen kind of throws you off, too, with the shit. I want to 
want to assume that where I'm going is over there. Fucked up sounds, man. This game definitely has some fucked up sounds going for it. Ah, uh, you know, let's fucking try it. Alright, that was what I was supposed to do there. It's weird, I'm like clipping edges though right now, it's kinda gross. I was gonna say, don't you do that to me, bro. We've been through this much together, we can do this now. Do I go here or do I go there? I don't know, where do I go? That doesn't look like anything. I'm gonna go here. This looks like it's intentionally leading me somewhere. <sighs> Floating doors! My favorite! Psycho's room. Alright. I know this is a puzzle, so I gotta go at least in the right order. That fateful night, the child lay upon the road, broken. Why do you have to walk that way so late, young man? Why did you have to be so foolish? Delusioned and embittered by his parents' words, the child was broken physically. Broken mentally. The men in white placed him in the rolling chairs. Now he laughed. How he laughed! And so he lived what remained of his life. One day fate smiled upon the child, and so he came upon the implement of his destruction. Decisions! Decisions! The outcome was not certain. Pro cap tu lictoris, abent sua fata libelli. That's Latin, and I have no idea what it means. Here, then here, and here. Nah, that wasn't it. Something changed. Okay, I didn't realize that. My bad. It changed everything when I went in the correct one. Okay. I'm a moron. Oh, this is so weird. I love it. Okay, I don't love it anymore. That was... wow, okay. Essentially, if I follow the left wall, I'm good, but... How much good will that do me? I'm gonna get fucked up. Well, let's do it, YOLO! Okay, there's maps throughout, got it. Oh, okay. Uh, 
Okay, that was creepy as balls. Alright. You will not survive. Interesting name for a level. What makes you so sure? Yeah, certain is the word I'm looking for. Certain. Oh, okay, nope. I didn't even hear a sound cue for you. Fuck that. Why? I am in a real life Pac Man situation. safe sometimes and you wind up just getting stuck in a permanent recurring like moving to the right thing I do not like this. I do not like rain ants and ham. Do not like them one bit, Sam I am. Okay, so hang on. There, the, 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 okay, follow the right wall essentially, and I'm good. All the freedom. Fuck you guys. Yes. God. He suffered severe spinal damage in the accident. It's a miracle he still retains upper body motion. From the waist down, however, there is no nervous response at all. Not to mention the mental trauma he suffered. From what I can tell, Simon is a deeply disturbed individual who had mental problems even prior to the accident. <laughs> This? Yes. Yes, it is. New chapter, though, means that my drops in that train are gone. So let's go ahead and hit a save point and end it there. objective right now. That's the thing that's weirding me out, though, is I don't know what to do. <sighs> Had a clear objective to get those fuses before, and now what is that objective? Oh, my guns are still here. Okay. So we're gonna hold, uh... <laughs> wording. It's not a good thing for me today. So we're gonna go ahead and uh, end this episode right here, folks, and I'll uh, get back into recording... Around that. Either way, I'll be recording a little bit later, but not now, not anytime soon, really. So, take it easy, everybody, and uh, yeah, hope you enjoyed.
Thank you.